grow your business in a recession part two. So in part one, we talked about being able to recognize patterns in our economy. Now we are moving into a recession, which means that times are harder. Most people are spending less money, which might mean you are receiving less sales for your business. Actually not a bad thing. It's a time that your business has a lot of opportunity. Let me give you an example. So one of my mentors, Tony Robbins runs a very, he actually runs like over a hundred companies. The main company he's known for is his speaking and the events and conferences that he puts on. Back in 2020, a good portion of his business was shut down because people were not able to meet in person. He tried to reschedule his events in so many different places, thank you, and he continued to get shut down. Now, you might think, well, maybe this is just not meant to be for him, maybe he needs to pick a different business, but instead he pivoted his business and he started doing more events online. He built this huge studio in his house with these 4K like screens and he can see like hundreds of people on Zoom and it's like this wrap around studio and he started running, <laughs> oopsies, the people who do this are honestly skilled. This is like, this is amazing to me started running these events out of his house, right? Now, usually as in-person events, he has anywhere from a couple hundred, 10,000 people. He's running these online events and they can reach millions of people. In fact, it means that instead of him being on the road 300 days a year, he was on the road much less. He actually was able to expand his family and they had a baby a year and a half ago because a very difficult economy actually gave him an opportunity for more scalability in his business and the ability to reach and impact more people. So right now the question for you as a business owner is, how can I create more scalability and impact and still grow my business? If you've got questions, go ahead and put them in the comments and we're gonna do a part three.